Well, Middle Barn Grain Store uh, was put up in time for harvest 2017 um, and it replaced an old set of farm buildings that dated back to the 1940s, 1960s um, and all that's really left is the stone barn here which one day will get converted into some sort of industrial use um, and the old bulk sheds over here which we use now for uh, fertiliser and seed storage, um, odd bits of plant machinery, things like that. Uh, we used to store about uh, 5,000 tonnes of grain here on site in, in bins and on, in these bunkers over here, uh, in these stores, and um, the new uh, capacity holds about 10,000 tonnes of wheat uh, in about 10 different parcel sizes. So we've got five bays of 500 tonnes, uh, four of 1,500 tonnes, and then one of 800 tonnes. Um, it's, uh, it's revolutionised the handling um, both of our grain and neighbours grain so we do a bit of contract um, storage for people primarily on oilseed rape have done some drying in the past as well for other people um, and then with the contract farming agreement next door and about the six and a half thousand tonnes of grain that we annually grow here um, that should just about bring this up to full capacity um, which is fantastic news so as well as putting up the grain store we've also installed the Weybridge and then round the corner we've got liquid fertiliser tanks, rainwater harvesting for a pressure washer and a wash down area, there's an oil separator um, underground in here <clears throat> and then we've also got um, a little lagoon and then soakaways before the water sort of heads off um, down, the, uh, down to the Carrant Brook. Um, grain itself is stored um, in, uh, in these sorts of bunkers. Uh, 65 ton an hour grain, uh, grain dryer, continuous flow, belt fed to these bunkers. This is one of the 1500 ton ones. Uh, it's a bit of uh, Crusoe from Harvest 2019. We've got some great um, crop conditioning equipment in here as well. So uh, remote sensors monitoring the grain temperature, um, comparing that with the air temperature outside and then switching ventilation fans on and off depending on um, the requirement to uh, to get the grain cooled um, which has worked really really well over the last few years so middle barn grain store handles the uh, the milling wheat malting barley both spring and winter oilseed rape peas beans linseed soybeans uh, and also we've got some quinoa in store uh, well not in store but in the ground this year for the British quinoa company so we'll uh, we'll see how that goes bit of a trial hectridge um, to have a look at that so Middle Barn Grain Store, Arable Main Centre.